Hello everybody, uh, welcome to my stream, I'm a legend man, and tonight uh, we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna do, a, a, we're gonna have a jackbox party, and um, yeah, just waiting for some people to get on, uh, I don't know how long we're gonna do this, but uh, yeah, we're gonna play some jackbox, and uh, yeah, let's see if we can get some people in and have some fun. Um, I don't, yeah, I don't know if we're gonna have enough people tonight, but maybe we'll see. Um, if we don't, we may, I may just cut the stream off, or I may do something else. So, yeah, um, let's see what happens. Um, so, um, the schedule, uh, next week, uh, we are continuing, uh, The Legend of Zelda, Link to the Past, uh, The Legend of Nert, <laughs> uh, as I named my character. Um, so Tuesday I'm gonna be off, of course, and then Wednesday we're gonna have Warzone Wednesday, Thursday... Uh, we're going to continue in Death Skin Marks, and uh, we're going to yeah we're going to play Death Skin Marks. We haven't played that in a while. And Friday we're going to do Star Wars Squadrons again. And uh, yeah, and then we're going to try I think on what was it the twenty six. We're going to try and play Cyberpunk on the twenty six. Yeah, I. I'm still pretty sick. Um, you won't you won't see much of my face, but um, yeah. Um, I hope you're all having a wonderful holiday. Uh, the news, um, yeah, Christmas time's coming. Uh, you know the holidays, you know Christmas, um, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever you celebrate. New Year's is coming too. Um, yeah, so we got some games in the pipeline coming out. Um, we got the Scott Pilgrim game, which is coming out January 14th. Uh, I plan on getting that, and um, I plan on getting... Um, what else do I plan on getting? Uh, I plan on getting... Oh, uh, what was that one game? Uh, yeah, My Minecraft Dungeons, right, 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 right. Uh, I plan on getting Minecraft Dungeons, and then I plan on getting uh, the... Super Mario 3D World uh, remaster game coming uh, next February. So, yep, um, that's gonna be the news. I'm still doing my skateboard giveaway. If you want to sub to my uh, uh, subscribe to my Twitch channel, um, you, you can be part of the uh, um, be part of the running for that. So, yes, um, I'm sorry I'm still sick, but I'm gonna do the best I can tonight. So, uh, let's play some Jackbox. Um, and please, and, and if you need. Here, I'll, I'll explain the rules of what we're going to do. So, um, I'm going to have Jackbox running. Um, I'm going to bring this over here. Uh, so, what you're going to do, um, you, see, you see my screen here? Uh, you got to go to jackbox.tv, and you're going to see this. You're going to see this screen, and you're going to click on this thing, and then you're going to click on your Twitch, and then that's going to, um, and then... Um, yeah, once you click on this, it'll it'll give you a run through uh, uh, what to do, and then you'll end up you'll end up back here with your login name. It'll be it'll be um, it'll be uh, crossed out with with your uh, Twitch login name, and then whenever the room code comes up, you enter the room code. It'll be like four letters. It'll be like you know XKCD, and then you enter the room code, and that'll get you into the game. And we uh, we'll wait and we'll start there. So that's how, that's how you enable your Twitch thing. That's how you uh, get into our games tonight. So um, we're going to start off with some Quiplash 3. So I got Party Pack 7 uh, up and ready to go. So let's do it. All right, here we go. Okay. All right, let's make sure we got the volumes and settings up oh, so. Full screen mode, okay. We are going to start off with Quick Flash 3 and um, the winners will be able to uh, pick the next game, so. Go into settings, make sure everything's on. 
audience, extended timers, password game, moderation, require Twitch, yes. Family friendly. Um, we're gonna be we're gonna be a little bit raunchy tonight, so yeah. <clears throat> Max players eight subtitles, yes. Okay. So let's go back here. I'm gonna. Okay. Uh. Okay. And there's your code. So if anybody wants to get in, Log in to jackbox.tv with your Twitch enabled account, and there you go. No tuxedo? Okay. So uh yeah, you need at least you need at least five people to play. And uh Yeah! Ugh. So we're waiting on one more, and uh, if you want to get in on the Discord, uh, I'll be in the Discord channels as well, in the Discord voice channel. <clears throat> so yeah, sorry I'm still sick, but this is, uh... Yeah! So, hope everyone's doing well tonight. Um, yeah. Let's see. Um, I'm gonna try and see if we can get at least one or two more people in. Gotta have at least five to play. Huh. <sighs> All right. See if anybody's I'm just it's gonna, it's gonna want to join in. start game somebody else is gonna join in so here we go we might get some uh, <coughs> we might get some players later but uh all right pay attention to your your uh, device hey welcome to quiplash 3 and here are the rules children of the quip Schmitty's my name and it's spelled nothing like it sounds Oh, and if you're not in the game, you can still kind of be in the game. Just punch in the room code and join the audience. Here's round one. You'll answer two prompts on your device in any way you want, and then each of your responses will square off against someone else's. The remaining players vote on their favorite. Easy, right? Points are scored based on the percentage of people who choose your response. Let's quit.
Okay. I got mine in. Time's almost done. Save your bacon with a safety quip. You got about 10 seconds. Come on. Come on. Do a safety quip. Right, right. Okay. Finally, let's see some action. I know. Um, usually, you gotta have a bunch of people is... play this game. I didn't but come we'll here to do. make friends. I came here to blank. It's choosing time. I didn't come here to make friends. I came here to find Waldo. I came here to chew, kick ass and chew our stripper ass. <laughs> Let's see the next one. The DNA test proves you are not the father, but you are blank. Time to pick the one you like best. The DNA test proves you are not the father, but you are DJ or the mother's brother, Sweet Home Alabama. <laughs> well, my name's Cletus, and uh, I'm from Alabama, and, I, and uh, I like my cousin, <laughs> and my sister's brother, and my mother's brother, too. Okay, what's next? Oh, the handcuffs in the bedroom? <laughs> they're not for sex, they're for blank. And my little brother breaks out of his pen. Now it gets real. Pick your favorite. <laughs> the handcuffs are not for... Better than after sex, they're for when my little brother breaks out of his pen. Or the ghosts. <laughs> little brother breaks out of his pen. That's great. Next up. That horror movie was so scary. Until the killer turned out to be blank. Uh, the okay, horror movie sca so scary until quit. the killer turned out to be the Columbia coffee, coffee guy and his donkey. Or a cat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I couldn't, I couldn't see, I couldn't vote on e either one. You survived round one. That one uh, the Columbia coffee guy, that was mine. Board? Next up is a little thing I call round two. Prompts are more out there, and the points are doubled. Okay, an uh, answer your devices. Where's part of it? Okay, I got mine in. Right, make sure you can... Make sure you get both your, uh... Quips in. Time's almost up! Use a safety quip if you're stuck! Come on, Tuxedo! Tuxedo, get in there. Let's have a look. At the front of the line is... This player took a DNA test. Turns out they're 100% blank. Not beef. Okay, show some love. <laughs> so I took a DNA test. Turns out they're 100% uh, old for this shit. 
Mountain Dew and Doritos. Oh god. If I say if I say too old for this sh <laughs> Yeah, I'm Danny Glover. Next we have The worst part about raising a zombie child is blank. Okay, choose your favorite. Uh, the worst part about raising a zombie child is is they always crowd ooh or the amount of brains they shit. <laughs> Next, the weird hazing ritual astronauts must endure on their first space mission. <laughs> and now, pick your favorite. <laughs> Eating those Armageddon. Okay. Uh, the weird hazing ritual astronauts must endure on their first space mission. Uh, wear a helmet everyone farted into, or eat those space pop rocks. <laughs> or again, space pop rocks. I'm gonna go to the helmet fart. <laughs> helmet fart is perfect. And next, the most important lesson in a social media class for senior citizens. Okay, the most important lesson in social decisions media class for decisions. senior citizens your is keeping your teeth in during selfies or don't fucking believe the lies on Facebook. <laughs> oh, the lies on Facebook, right? Yeah. Exactly. All right, exactly. Let's on round two and see those scores. Alright, Tuxedo still the lead. Riplash. A final chance to make a splash. You'll each receive a prompt that requires three separate responses. That's triple the ha ha's. Okay. Okay, got my three answers in. Okay. Hmm. You got plenty of time. Time's running out. All right. Oh, time's up. Let's see what you've done. What are we gonna... The three unique things you offer the world are... Good. Come lay down your weapons. <laughs> so, it's the three unique things you offer the world are I am a god, come lay down your weapons, or entertainment, bunnies, and love. Oh, that's mine. I offer entertainment, bunnies, and love. Name three things you're looking forward to. Trump's, 
Let's be positive. Name three things uh, All right, you look people, forward to. Trump time. losing the same election. <laughs> the ability to go outside some pop rocks after that last. Uh, a time machine to 2021. Wait, the future also sucks. Death would be great. Ooh, it's, it's just... Nihilistic. Uh, the ability to go outside, I'd go with that one. <laughs> Nothing to do now but see those final scores. Okay. Oh, I pull out ahead. All right. All right. So you know what? We're gonna do another round of this. We're gonna we're gonna uh, we're gonna redo the room, and I'll give you guys the room code. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna do another one of these, but uh, here, let me get the room code going. So, okay. Okay, here we go. There's the room code. BMQW. If you want to join in, go to jackbox.tv. Make sure you enable your Twitch account. And, uh, yeah, just waiting for people to get in. Wait, there's a... <laughs> there's a poop one? There's a quiplash poop emoji? Oh my gosh, I did not see that coming. Alright. That's crazy. Okay, uh, I know we got some new viewers coming in. Why don't you guys come and join us? Uh, we need some more players, so uh, log into jackbox.tv. You, uh, link your Twitch account, and then, uh, yeah, use your Twitch account, and then we'll, uh, go to jackbox.tv, and then put in the room code here, and uh, we'll give everybody a few more minutes, actually, let's do, uh, do about two minutes. Because, uh, yeah. Friend was pretty good, even though we had a small group, so. Uh. Okay. <sighs> okay. Any last people want to join in? Going once. Last people want to join in, going twice. 
Unless people want to join in going three times. And... All right, here we go. Prepare yourself for Quiplash 3, Race to the Bottom. I'm Schmitty, and I'll be providing humor, support, and vital instructions someone will probably talk over. Let's kick it off with round one. You'll rake in the points based on the percentage of people who dig your response. Got it? Great! All right, answer your devices now. Let's. Okay, I got my quips in. All right, you, tuxedo, you got about Time fifteen seconds. Out. Safety quip it if you have to. All right, we got them all oh, in. I am so ready for this next part. And we start with the worst thing to use as confetti. Baby said a baby shower. Yeah, what? Both. It's the theme. <laughs> or as an ice cream topping. I'm gonna go with the baby's thing. Okay, that was funny. And here we have... When your Roomba is charging, what does it dream about? When your room is charging, right, what does it dream for the about? You, like you best. picking up after goddamn self. <laughs> or hoping the cat doesn't need a ride. <laughs> picking up after your goddamn self. That's that's pretty that's a pretty good one. I like that. And that was great. Is that was great, I like that. Nickname for babies born ten years from now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, choose your favorite. <laughs> generational nickname for babies born ten years from now. The most ungrateful generation <laughs> ever, said the old man. Or fucked, probably. Um, yeah. The ungrateful generation is most likely, but... You know, fucked and screwed is the most likely answer of generations because of how our... Next on our the docket, world, our world is a so. terrible idea for a children's pop-up book, The Adventures of Blank. A terrible idea Here's for a children's pop-up book, Pick The Adventures quip. of the St. Valentine's Day Massacre. Ooh, no, ooh, ooh, bad. Uh, or the angry truck driving lesbian. <laughs> Oh, you guys are horrible. Okay, let's not dwell on <laughs> You guys are very horrible. <laughs> Sounds like an amazing kid's two book. Is upon us. Put on your best <laughs> quick face because the points are double <laughs> and the tension is thick. Yeah, yeah it does. It, it does, Cap. All right. 
Okay, that must have told me last lane of mystery now, probably. Oh wait, that- oh, I'm sorry, I wasn't supposed to say that, I'm, I'm very sorry. Okay, I got my answers in. Okay, 30 seconds. Ah, uh, there's seconds left. Use a safety clip if you have to. Alright. Seven, six, five. Four. Oh, just in the nick of time. Right, no time like the present. First, but not necessarily best, is... The most disappointing last line of a mystery novel, probably. Plot twist. Okay, the okay, most disappointing last away. line of a mystery novel, probably. Uh, plot twist. There is, There was no mystery. <laughs> Or, he hid the body and got away. Moving right along. An awesome side effect of climate change, hopefully. So it, now it gets real. Pick so your favorite. So an awesome effect of climate change, hopefully. It gets hot, so there's more ice cream trucks. <laughs> Beat from property with snowbirds in the way. Uh, we already have beachfront property in, with snowbirds in the way in Florida anyway, so it really doesn't matter, so I'm gonna go with the ice cream trucks. And now, how can you tell an artificial intelligence has turned evil? Time how can you tell you an like AI best. has turned evil? They become robotic trumps. I'm sorry, I can't answer that, David. Okay. Um. <laughs> okay, I like. I like. Let's keep it going. I like both really answers. Really terrible job would be the brand ambassador for blank. <laughs> Open the pod bay doors, Hal. Yeah, really. Uh, now really... it's time to vote for your favorite. <laughs> a really terrible job would be brand ambassador for Coca-Cola Clear vibrators. Coca-Cola Clear. It, it's just water. It's just carbonated water. Round two is through. Let's see how things shook out. Ah, I got no points. I got no points. I got no Welcome points. Welcome to Griplash, where points flow like honey. On your device, you'll see a prompt that requires <laughs> three separate responses. <laughs> Remember, oh, cousin, that's great! Pressure. That's great! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Vibrators don't need an ambassador, there's always a buzz about them. <laughs> that's perfect!
Okay, I got my answers in. You guys got plenty of time. Seconds. Tick tock, time's almost up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. No, let's take a peek. Three things a cowboy would say besides howdy. Right, people. He thinks the cap who would say besides howdy. Uh ma'am, sir, or he spits. No. Uh he would or something racist, pilgrim, or new sheriff. Spelled wrong, of course. Three things that'll put you right to sleep. <laughs> Vote for the one you like best. Three things that'll put you right to sleep. Too much whiskey, NyQuil, a large rock to the face, or I like to do a little trick. All I, all I gotta do is call up a friend to, to knock me the fuck out. <laughs> oh, um, large rock to the face. Okay. I like the second one, because that has a little bit of a story to it. And that is it. Well, except right. for this last Tuxedo, part. Tuxedo, I think you won. Okay, Tuxedo, let me know what game you want to play next. I have Party Packs uh, 3 through 7. And I have Drawful 2. If you don't say anything, um, I will choose the game for everybody. But I think the next game we're going to play is Fibbage, so... Let me know what game you want to play next. Uh... We can do Trivia Murder Party, we can do more Quiplash, we can do, uh... You do I like Survive the Internet. You want to do Survive the Internet? Okay, we'll do Survive the Internet. Let's do that's on party pack four, I think. Yes, that's on party pack four. Okay, we're lo we're loading this up. So tuxedo wants to do survive the internet. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. Let's make sure we got everything ready and set to go. Okay, survive the internet. Uh, Alright, let's go to settings. Okay. Full screen mode, audience, extended timers, required Twitch. Okay. Alright, I am going to get the room code. And, uh, be with you guys in just a second. Here. Hello. So, Tuxedo, thank you for the follow. I do appreciate it. Mm, hey, I am in. Here is the room code. So, we're going to play a little game with, uh, called Survive the Internet. Um, how this works is that you're given... I gotta go. Oof. Crap, okay. Okay, Tuxedo. Uh... 
All right. Tuxedo, thanks for the follow. Uh, we'll see you next time, brother. Maybe it's Asuna? Okay. Okay. All right. Alright, a gang of four. Please tell me you're not another group of hackers. Don't forget you can join the audience at any time. Alright, okay, you never played this Mikey's before? Tagline, we'll, uh, let's do this. We'll let the tutorial play out. Just listen. I'm Todd, and that's with two Ds, so keep an eye out for my friend request. Before we begin, check out this quick tutorial. Hey guys, what's up? It's Partyboy7, here to teach you how to play Survive the Internet. So, in each round, you'll get a prompt on your device. Go ahead and answer it. Those responses will then be sent to another player. The objective is to twist these words in the most ridiculous way possible. So if my friend Paul said selfie sticks are, quote, super dumb, then I would take him out of context. Say we're on a news site. Their super dumb would be an outrageous comment to what headline? Oh, I got it. Everybody then votes on whose comment looks the most absurd. I get rewarded for writing the twist, and Paul gets some pity points for looking foolish. The person with the most points at the end of the game wins. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Please. I feel so empty inside. Let's start things off at a video site. Okay, here we go. So, look at the prompt okay, on, you're on your device. On your device. Don't overthink your response. And just follow your gut. Put your opinion in. So. Okay, once once your uh, prompt goes out, it'll go to another player, and then you get their prompt You're getting back. Another player's answer on your device, and then Take you these words uh, out of context in the most ridiculous way you, you can. You respond to their uh, prompt. I'm becoming a father. What? What? Do you regret your decisions? It's too late now. Okay, here we go. Can't bear it gone wrong. Let's see gone sexual guy hated because I was in the Boy Scouts. Oof. That was bad. New cat. <laughs> New cat president takes office. <laughs> Please retire for the love of God. <laughs> Kardashians get a new look this season. Gross. <laughs> kind of funky. GL. Vote for the okay. Wait, think vote for your the vote for the best contest. one that you like. I mean, I know who I'd vote for, but it's up to you. Let's see who got the points. Here's who burned you. They get some points. And you, the victim, get some pity points. 
Woof. I'm glad I'm not you. No. Let's All see right. where everyone stands at the moment. So, what do you think of this so far? Alright. Okay, let's move All right, on. Next category. Let's go to a social media site. Your What's second prompt, prompt is being okay. sent to your device. Please answer it. inspires you take this quote out of I got a lot of today so it makes it hey Sullivan how you doing um yeah there is um there is a little bit of delay um usually it's five to ten seconds Yeah, also, Solvent, welcome to the stream. Uh, thank you for joining us on Jackbox. Um, this is a twice a month thing that I'm starting. And uh, thank you for coming. Uh, please enjoy your stay. If, if you'd like, uh, hit the follow button. How many carpets? Please don't uh, roll, uh, roll dead bodies in them. <laughs> Good parody ad. All right. Um, yeah, it's, there's usually like a five to ten second delay. So I put, that's why I put on extended timers. So you guys have extra time. Alright. Okay, there we I've go. got a bad feeling about this. New convention held in Florida. Oh god. Would you have a sick vomit splash? Ew. Bunch of hippies never bothered anyone anyway. Blessed hashtag. Or hashtag. You just think that's it. Drug Vader is still screwed. I know it's secrets. That's great. Here are your candidates. Now place your votes. Uh. <laughs> Let's see how everybody voted. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That <laughs> your parents are watching. Crowd. <laughs> Convention held in Florida brings crowds. Yep. That is that is so completely true. How will that shuffle the leaderboard? Let's find out. Let's switch things up and go to a uh, web forum. Oh, web forums. Okay. okay. Another prompt is it's your prompt on your device. Now please get to it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, just be mindful that there is a small delay. 
Uh, it depends usually on the broadcast server that I broadcast to, or your connection. If you have a really slow download speed, that could hinder the broadcast delay a little bit longer. So, I broadcast to Let's Atlanta, the by twist. the way. Okay, so it may be either your connection or, oh, like seven seconds? Okay, that's not too, too bad. Usually it's what like, you rascals came up with. usually like the bigger delays are like 15. <laughs> Where'd you learn to drive, Walmart? <laughs> Bulldog saved uh, from alligator. This song is news. They should call him Pete, am I right? Do your civic duty and vote now. Oh, the I'm seven. Here's what people think. That is so good. I, where'd you learn to drive, Walmart? Yeah, the kid had a power wheel. <laughs> if you're seven, you probably got a power wheels. Let's check out the scoreboard, shall we? And our last stop of the game will be at, uh... Okay, photo, photo sharing. sharing. Give this one your all, because points are worth double in this round. I caught this weird dog. All right, pick All right, a photo. Here's your last prompt. You know what to do. Okay, now you make a ca okay, you make a caption for somebody else's night. photo. Time to hit a slam dunk. is really really gross i love it okay let's see how you've grown as writers can't wait to work at mcdonald's oh oh that is so true <laughs> put a new orchard group just teaching you how to listen to loosen up those hips oh god Please <laughs> creep on a mountain. Uh, just out here with my best friend. Okay, that's that feels okay, like tr that feels like balance. truthfulness. But yeah, the graduation one is oh too true. Here are the results. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, it all comes down to this. Joke. <laughs> okay. Alright, that was the last one. So, we Panda wins! Now enjoy your so, Panda. Prize. 
What would you like to play next? We can we can play any game out of any of the party packs, uh, three through seven. Uh, we could do murder trivia trivia party. We could do TKO. We could do drawful. Uh, we could do uh, robot rat battles. We can do uh, more quiplash. Another trivia. Yes, we can do a trivia murder party. We'll do a trivia murder party too. Uh, yes, we will do, we will do Trivia Murder Party. Uh, I'm gonna go now. Okay, uh, Solvent, um, we'll see you another time, hopefully. If you, uh, if you, if you like the, if you like the stream, you can, uh, hit the follow button there. The big purple heart. So, okay. Trivia Murder Party. I think that is... that is Party Pack... oh yeah, six. Um, we can also do... there's also other games that we can play. Uh, there's like Joke Boat... There's... there's other stuff too. Uh, Dictionarium... Uh, push the button. Nah, I, I wouldn't recommend push the button though. Uh, but trivia murder party two. Here we go. Basically, what you do in the, in this in trivia murder party is you answer trivia questions, and if you get them wrong, you play a deadly mini game. Okay, so full screen, audience, get tutorials, or Twitch, post game sharing, station mini game, okay. All these games, yep, okay. So, let me go back to my webcam here. I am going to get a room for us. Okay. Room code. Okay, here we go. Here is the room code. CSTM. If anybody wants to join in, um, everybody's welcome to join in as long as they're uh, logged in on Twitch. If they have their Twitch account linked on jackbox.tv. Huh. Okay, we're gonna give it a few minutes. Uh... I'll we'll give it about a few good minutes. So, yeah, what you do is you, you answer trivia questions on random topics. And... The more answers you get right, or the more survival mini-games that you win, you get more money. And whoever has more money is the one that's alive. Now, the ghost can fight it out for the other person's soul to escape. So, if you die, you're still in the game. But, uh, the end game is where you have to steal the, uh, the winning person's soul and you have to escape the hotel. You'll see how, you'll see how it is, um, and each mini game is different. There's there's like puzzles, there's math, there's drawing, uh, and there's you know choose an item. Uh, there's a tattoo game, and it's really this is just really really stupid fun, and this is this is like a fan favorite of a lot of people, but my favorite game is TKO. So. Alright, any other people going once? Any other people going twice? Any other people going three times? Alright. 
Here we go. This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. You just checked in to a game of murder. Only one of you will survive. I'm running a hotel and killing people. I've achieved work-life balance. Okay, first question. Yin and Yang are symbols central to which religion? Use your device to answer the question. Uh, I want to say Buddhism, but... And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Uh-oh. Which means only you. Come with me. Somebody's gonna play a mini-game. And they might die. To the killing room. Ah, the old skewer's trick. Pick a space in this box to hide yourself. When this was used in magic shows, there were safeguards inside to prevent injury. But don't worry, I took those out. Of course, this magic trick does need some volunteers. Volunteers get one sword. On your device, choose a row or a column to run your sword through. Sword is a weird sounding word, right? Stab, stab! That's gotta hurt! Oof! And my cousin is dead, but don't worry, you can still win the game. We're not done with you yet. Everyone who dies in this hotel turns into a ghost. Keep playing, and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. Now pay attention, you're still in the game, don't worry. Let's keep moving. Which of these poker hands is the best? Two pair, flush, full house, straight. Um... I gotta go with, uh, Full House, because John Stamos. He's so sexy, I wanna give him hugs. Who picked... this? Yes! What I was gonna really get it right. Ha <laughs> It's time. I have no idea about Welcome cards. To room 237. Uh, I went to Vegas once. That's how I know. This one lets you protect yourself with the password. Enter a real four-letter word with your device. Make it hard to guess. If your password gets cracked, you die. <coughs> Everyone else will try to crack the password. Sorry, cough there. As a team, guess the password on your device. You get a clue if your guess has a letter in the right spot. If anyone figures out the password before time runs out, I will reward you all. This is a team effort, so share clues out loud with each other. Okay, so it starts with an F. Stop. I thought everyone was good at hacking passwords these days, but I guess I was wrong. 
Ooh. Oh! I wonder if Pat Sajak ever had to move back into his parents' house. The path to stardom is not always a straight line, you know. I saw that on a I had nothing. once. Oh, I'm saved? Yeah. Yeah, nobody guessed your password, so you're saved. What's if we guessed your password, one? you would have died. Which colorful book came first? Uh, I want to say it was. Who picked this? Oh no! I want to show you something. Let's see if the safe players are good at forgery. Oh, hey, look. The ghost of my Aunt Mildred is writing on this mirror. She has her own consistent handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will everyone else. Draw a word on the mirror to camouflage Aunt Mildred's. Start writing on that mirror. Pay attention to the words as they appear and try to spot my auntie. <laughs> so many convincing words to choose from. Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote or you die. Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Ah! Uh... Aunt Mildred would like never say that. Let me show you what's behind the looking glass. I'm dead. Okay. Panda, you got to escape before we before we get you. The final round is close. Next oh wait, no. Question. Nope. Who was in the funny pages first? Uh, it has to be Ziggy. I'm gonna say Ziggy. Who picked this? Blondie. Well, that person has a hard glass. Follow me. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let's see who has ESP. Type in an answer that fits this category. Ooh. Everyone else will answer too. And if anyone matches you, you die. Write your answers now. Okay, got my answer in. Now, let's see if there are any matches. Well, I guess mind reading doesn't exist after all. Did I say that out loud? Oh, I think you survived. Yep, you survived. Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Uh oh. Here we go. The chase is on. The chase is on. Glad to see you're the one to make it here alive. But will you be the one to escape? I'm going to give you a category. Kubler Ross by stages of grief. Tap each answer that fits the category and then press let's see the right answers. You advance one space for every correct answer. You're a little bit closer to escaping. Plot twist, all the ghosts get to play too. If a ghost catches up with you, they will steal your life force. Uh oh. They can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Time is almost up. Uh oh. Next question. Poems that rhyme. Okay. Okay. Ah! Oh. 
Let's just call that a fluke. Monsters mentioned in the song, The Monster Mash. Okay. The Crypt ki Kicker 5? Okay. Don't fall behind. It's only darkness. Always happen on a Sunday. Time is almost up. I think all of them do. Oh, no, I was wrong. Uh. Countries with red, white, and blue flags. Yep, yeah, okay, we're all right about that one. Ugh, I gotta get some harder questions. Okay. Moving on. James Patterson novels. Uh, I'm scared. Do you want King of Spider? Uh, yeah. I think Along Came a Spider is the only one. Oh! They all were, okay. Don't look back because there's a ghost right there. I have no idea. Fortnite skins. Fortnite skins. Oh, I don't know Fortnite. Uh. Time. Oh, we're so close! Oreo cookies! Universe Cups, uh... Time is okay, I know they're sugar-free, and Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Okay, they all were, okay. Oh, wait! No! No, I gotta escape! I have to escape! <laughs> you need a perfect answer for your final escape. Oh yeah, perfect answer in order to escape. And that includes the third answer choice now too. Aww. You have to get all the right answers to escape. Oh! Yeah! I did it! I did it! I escaped! You guys died. <laughs> Boo! Boo! Legend Man survives. Yes! Okay, uh... So what do you think of that game? Alright, we're gonna do... I think we should do joke boat. Uh, or bleh. we should do joke boat next. So, what'd you, what'd you guys think? Was that was that fun or scary or what? But uh, I was at the end, but yeah, I was at the trivia, but that was great. Um. I wanted to, I wanted to do joke boat. I haven't done joke boat in a long, long time. But let's make sure I have this set up right. And Bass Ty, how you doing, buddy? Um, yeah, we. I want to get you in. Uh, I want to get you in here. Let's see, host volume. Okay, uh, audience, that's all in. Twitch, post game sharing. Okay, all right. Joke boat. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna go back to my screen here. All right. Uh, I have no idea how to play Jackbox though. Okay, here's what here's what you do. Okay, go to go to Jackbox.tv. Okay. Uh, go to Jackbox.tv. Okay. 
Here, we're gonna. Here, I'm gonna show. I'm gonna show you how to do this, real quick. Uh. Okay, I'm gonna show you. Uh, fast time. I'm gonna show you how to do this. Okay. You go. To, you go to this website, Jackbox.tv. Okay. And then you're gonna log in with your Twitch account. So here's how you do it. Toot toot. We gotta scoot. Um. So go to jackbox.tv, go to this little button right here, and then click the Twitch button, and then follow the prompts through that, and then it'll take you back to this to this uh, um, to this screen with your with your Twitch login name, and then you uh, do the four letter uh, word code that we give you when it pops up. So, do you have all that? Okay, so I'm gonna enter the room code right now. I have the room come up here, and I'll I'll give I'll give everybody the room code. Okay, I am in. There is the room code. Jackbox.tv. And there's the room code, uh, DDWF. I have extended timers, I have the audience, it, and I require Twitch. And yeah, you, you can do this on, uh, you can do this on a, on a browser tab or oh, a mobile please, device. Whenever you're ready. By the way. So, okay, so each uh, each Jackbox mini game has has a different rule set. So uh, you're gonna you're gonna listen to the rules here, and then we'll play. <laughs> the C minus. Gather round, comedians. Here's tonight's itinerary. We're gonna write some jokes and then test them out on stage. But first things first, it's brainstorming time. Before we jump into the jokes, let's do a little writing exercise to get inspired. On your device, you'll be prompted to write various topics like animals, people, or objects. Fill in whatever you think has a lot of comedic potential. If another player uses one of your topics in a winning joke, you'll get some bonus points. Generate as many as you can. You have 45 seconds, starting now. Okay, I extended the timer, so you got a minute. Just like my premium cable bundle, this writing exercise is ending soon. Oh. All right, it's joke writing time. Follow the steps on your device to construct two hilarious jokes. Okay. Uh...
Move on to your second joke soon. Hey, mayonnaise. Hey. How you doing? What's up? Um, we're in the middle of joke boat, so, but, uh, if you want to join the audience, uh, the, um, We've got a great group of Join at jackbox.tv. Uh, we're Let's doing good. We're doing joke boat right now. The but uh the the room code is DDWF. Alright. Uh cousin, you ready? <laughs> My doctor said I have a bad case of skeletons. <laughs> <laughs> because one got stuck inside me. <laughs> Ring a ding philosophy. <laughs> okay. Uh on the joke for me. My grandma said the best thing about office parties is stripping the boss of his dignity. <laughs> <laughs> Give me cult. Yeah. Who won this joke off? Place your vote now. Okay, now now you vote you vote on which one you like best. Okay, points. I got none. Here's another comedian, whether you like it or not. All right, fast eye. You ready? Remember to say your catchphrase. It's the mola. It doesn't actually exist. Oof. <laughs> Call me nihilism. Alright, Panda, you ready? You just do uh, hit the joke, do the joke for me. <laughs> Any more corporate ladders than corporate benefits. <laughs> right? Try me a mandated curfew. Which joke was funnier? Vote now. Alright. I like I like the corporate joke. That was funny. Okay, up next. Okay. the joke for me. <laughs> you ever notice how Gollum looks like a Sally Struthers commercial child? Give me cult. <laughs> Alright, Bass Tiger, you're up next. Middle school for me was like Frankenstein. <laughs> A jumble of human bodies <laughs> screaming. Yup. Yup. <laughs> Call me nihilism. Yeah. Alright. Everybody vote on your favorite one. Oh, Bastide I get some points. All right. And I got no points cuz I am not funny. And I I'm an actual amateur stand up comedian. Welcome our next comic to the stage. All right, Panda, you're up next. How many plural nouns does it take to change a light bulb? Three. One to screw it in, two to be politically incorrect. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Crime you may need a curfew. Alright, cousin, you're up next. A group of dragons walk into a bar. And <laughs> burn it the fuck down. <laughs> Very, uh, ring a ding philosophy. Yeah. Both of them are very good, but, uh,. I'm gonna go with politically incorrect. Yeah. And 
some credit to you. Mm. Horrible joke. Yeah, it was horrible, but it was great. Okay, you jokers. Let's tally the scores. Oh, this is ship shaping up to be a hot night of hoots and ha ha's. Okay. All right, the C minus. Round two, everything's double. Same stuff. Uh, it looks okay, familiar. It's all jokes. it's all Jackbox games. Okay. Okay, my jokes are in. Uh, yeah. How many plastic bottles are in? Uh, oh, I couldn't read all that. Okay. Uh, made good progress in my self-help book. I, I, cat, I, I, cat, and got put yourself first. Yeah, funny. If you haven't started your second joke yet, now would be the time. All right. Don't use the sun at 7 a.m. It's a great spot for crying alone. Oh. All right. You got let. You got slightly less than a minute. bacon on my salad today because I'm a bad boy. Yeah! Bacon bits are awesome. Excuse me. Alright, you got about 20 seconds. Okay, here we go. Okay, folks. Put your Cousin, you're up first. Welcome our comics back to the stage. All right, do the do the joke for you. When I was a kid, we didn't have workouts. <laughs> we had to walk uphill both ways. That was a good grandpappy joke. We had to walk 40 miles both ways through snow. Get to school. Have you heard about the plunger challenge? <laughs> That's where you take control of the Federal Bureau of Offices. Oh wait, ignore that. Ignore this Agent Hernandez. In the snow. Oh, okay. Which comedian told a better joke? Both of them are pretty good, but uh, I want to. I'm gonna go with the old man joke. <laughs> yeah, we'd walk uh, we'd walk uphill both ways in the snow. And a tip of the hat to you. And Basti got some uh, bonus All right, points. Let's hear it for our next. Comedian. All right, Basti, you're up next. Do the joke for you. My grandma said the best thing about gardens is. Flowers aren't the only things that you can bury in them. Call me nihilism. All right, do the joke for me. Marriage is a lot like influencers. <laughs> they lie to you and make you feel good about yourself. 
Give me Colt. Nice job, you two. Judges, what do you think? Uh, 50-50 split. Okay. Keep that applause going for our next comedian. All right, Penny, you're up next. My hometown's nickname is the Inside of Porta Potty. Because it's literally a port in New in New Jersey. In New Jersey. <laughs> Crimea mandated curfew, but it's a very true story. I keep missing the vote because of the delay. Ah, okay. Just, just, just pay attention to your vi uh, to your device. Or are they called loaded nachos and not technically drizzled triangles? <laughs> called nihilism. Yeah. I, I like the New Jersey joke. Yeah, um, with Jackbox, there's usually, like like I said earlier, um, there's a 5 to 10 second delay. Want some more comedy? Well, here it comes! Okay, perform the joke for me. Why did the portable toilet cross the road? Because it was tired of all the shit. <laughs> Give me coal! Alright, cousin, you're up next. The family is a lot like Gordon Ramsay. Oh no. They won't stop swearing at me. I'm kind of okay with it, with it for some reason. Oh, dude. Dude. Give me crazy. It's too close to home. True? True? Uh, yeah, the Gordon Ramsay thing. That's, that's too far, dude. I mean, I, I can imagine, you know, I can imagine your sister's cursing at you for no reason. Okay, what are the scores? What are the scores? If you're currently losing, might I suggest writing funnier jokes? Just something to think about. Yeah, my, my jokes suck. Just a joke, no worries. All right, the third and final round. And the boat is sinking and on fire. Well, we're sinking again. There's no time to write jokes from scratch. So, here's the plan. Let's rewrite another comics joke. You'll use the same setup, but we'll attempt to write a funnier punchline. The better the original joke did, the more points you'll earn for beating it. Can you steal the spotlight before the boat sinks? Let's find out. <laughs> right, rewrite another comics joke. Uh... Okay, I got my joke in. Yeah, for me. When push comes to shove, that's how I get off this boat alive. Yeah. Alright, you got less than a minute.
<laughs> Say goodbye to the, uh, all the pastures so that they can survive as well. Uh, Leave a good review. Okay, here we go. Please leave your personal belongings behind, but bring your laughter back for our performers. Okay, our boat's dying, and cousin, you're up next. Middle school for me was like uh, like Frankenstein. <laughs> Just wanted to find an ass, a chest, and maybe a head for for my monster. <laughs> okay, that's good. That's a chuckle. Did they successfully beat this joke? Vote now! Uh, oh, yeah, it's a good vote for the original. Yeah, vote on the original joke as well. Okay. Alright. Alright, Bast, how you're up. Tell a joke for you. Fucking do a bar. And ate the bartender. Yeah. No, I like the original. I like the original joke better. Yeah, it's like it's like Tiamat walks into a bar and burns it the hell down. When I was a kid, we didn't have workouts. We had to run away from the cops for throwing rocks at them. <laughs> okay. We had to walk uphill both ways. In the snow! Okay, so well, I got some points. All right, Pandy, you ready? I did the portable toilet across the road because there is a new construction on the on Road Forty One, as always. Ah, uh, yeah, Highway Forty One in Florida. <laughs> Yay! I won that one! Only one of you can get a life vest! Oh, Bastai wins! Alright, Bastai, you get to pick the next game. Do you know anything about Jackbox? Uh, we can play more of this, we can play other games. Um, any game that's streamable. Uh, I know Jack all. Okay. Uh, do you want to do You Don't Know Jack? Um, personally I don't like that game because it's kind of weird. It's like way, way too weird. Um, we can do a drawing game, we can do, uh, um, we can do a trivia game, we can do, uh, a lying game. Uh, my choice is I'll let you pick. Okay, um, you know what? We're gonna do my favorite. We are gonna do my favorite. We are gonna do TKO. We are gonna pull up T, uh, we're gonna pull up TKO, because TKO is the best Jackbox game ever. Basically... You make your own t-shirts. And you can actually buy the t-shirts at the end of the game. Alright, let me get this set up. Uh, okay, that's all good. Alright, TKO. 
I'm gonna head out. Gotta prepare for this, this snowstorm tomorrow. Have a good one. It was fun. All right, Panda, you take care. Be safe. Um, don't walk uphill both ways. All right, we're gonna make sure everything's on here. So we got uh, okay. Extended timers, audience, extended Twitch, start game from controller, room co hiding. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna hide the room code for a minute. Okay. So, um, so here's what we're gonna do. Uh, that's the room code. Okay. Okay, hang on, almost ready. Almost ready. Okay, and now we show the room code. There we go. Go to jackbox.tv. Uh, make sure you have your uh, Twitch login ready. And then uh, there's the room code. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, mayonnaise, if you want to take over for uh, Panda, that'd be great. If anybody else wants to join in, I'll give everybody a couple minutes. Uh, now, in this game, uh, what you do is you create three drawings. Uh, you uh, Each drawing, you're given about uh, about two minutes, roughly two minutes. Uh, Thane afflicted with the Ronus. Uh, no, I am not afflicted with the Ronus. It is, uh, a bad cough and a runny nose. Um, so yeah, pick your character, uh, write in, write in your winning slogan. And here's how this goes. So, uh, you're gonna write, uh, you're gonna draw three, uh, you're gonna make three drawings, draw anything that you like, as long as it's not super, super dirty. Like, don't draw dicks, don't draw, uh, you know, don't draw anything, you know, racist, sexist, or anything like that. You can make it dirty, but don't make it, like, super racist, super sexist, or anything like that. Um... And then, after you make each of your three drawings, you're going to come up with as many taglines as possible. After, you after the timer runs out and you make all the, uh, all the slogans, and remember, you have to submit everything. You have to submit the drawings and you have to submit the slogans each time. So make sure you get your... Uh, uh, make sure you, you can also pick t-shirt colors and you can draw whatever you want. So, yeah. Also, um, yeah, make sure you submit your taglines. Make them funny, and then when it, when everybody's done, you mix and match the uh, you mix and match the t-shirt colors, the drawings, and the taglines, and then that's your shirt. And you, you make sure you submit, and that's your shirt. Well, yeah, you can draw dirty pictures. Just don't draw dicks or you know anything racist. So, all right, are we ready? Here we go. And anybody can join in the audience as well. Welcome to TKO. I am the tournament master. Well, actually, I'm his identical twin. This, brother, but in my opinion, dentist, is the best so in. Jackbox game. <laughs> I brought you all here to T-Shirt Island to have the wildest spring break of our lives. Oh wait, no, that's the next group. You guys are here for the t-shirt thing? Welcome to the training grounds. You will use your device to draw three drawings. Draw something cute, something gross, something funny. Honestly, I don't care what you draw, but if you need help, hit the suggestion button. It's time for your first drawing right now. 
Remember, you, you could you could erase. You can pick all the different colors. But you can pick your uh, T-shirt color, and uh, you know, just draw whatever you want. And there's also the uh, pen size. Decent enough, but a bit traditional. Uh, this time, okay. try changing now your second drawing. The little tabs at the bottom. Begin Pick a different shirt color. Drawings. And then do another drawing. Just anything you want. Just don't make it sexist or racist. You make it dirty. But nothing like super racist or sexist, so. Yeah. Otherwise, I might have to censor it. And I don't want to get banned on Twitch. Okay, I got my second drawing in. Okay, you got less than 30 seconds. Okay. 10. Nine, about to expire. Eight, you may want to finish up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go. Ooh. Last drawing. Let's get weird with it. Begin. Never. Don't forget to hit submit.
Okay. Challenge complete. All right, now for taglines. For your last exercise, you will write as many slogans or phrases as you can. Something short and snappy like you might see on a t-shirt. And don't forget that suggestion button if you're stumped. Go. They were just submit, uh, submit every uh, slogan after you write it. Well, I know that's not your best material. Write another. Only seconds remain. Ah, okay, here we go. Now we start, now we start voting. Oh, wait, no, no. We, we mix and match everything, and then we vote. Now point your eyes at your device. You have a series of drawings and slogans at your disposal. Choose one of each to make the best t-shirt champion that you can. Don't phone it in. <laughs> okay. Excellent. All right, now the we vote. Come. Let the tournament begin. Gauntlet one. <laughs> 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 the shirt on the right. No, that was both my droid and my slogan. <laughs> Lost this the election. Versus. I missed the deadline for the second shirt. <laughs> uh. Oh, so both of both of these are my droids. <laughs> I tried to draw a crappy dragon. <laughs> it was the deadline for the second shirt. Nice of you to admit that. Oh, a new challenger up here. <laughs> the mighty magic man. <laughs> I can't read. Uh, nude beach shirt. <laughs> <laughs> going in now. Oh, I need a breather. Let's take a training break. Uh, if you have a, like a full load of players playing this, it gets super Use your great. Use devices to enter one new drawing and as many new slogans okay, so as you wish. Okay, so make a new drawing and proud. then more slogans. Go. And then you mix and match with the other pile of shirts.
Okay. Forget my drawing. Start writing. Alright. Four slogans. Do it. Okay. The second gauntlet. Mix and match, everybody. Mix and match. Remember, the old shirts are in this pile too. Slogans. Dream up something special. I've got a good feeling about this batch. Gone too. You read this. I did a good job. Fight for me, baby. Uh. So the Michigan S's or the Michigan Chain Link versus the poop in the snow. You can read this. I did a good job. A tie on the first battle. Fine, I'll choose. Challenger appears. <laughs> oh, this is so good! That is so good! <laughs> Toilet chocolate is good! <laughs> oh my god, I'm tiny! Toilet chocolate is good! <laughs> I'm sorry. It's so good. Oh crap! No! No toilet chocolate. Oh, you winners look good. Oh my god! It is here, and only the best shirts from the previous rounds were made. The toy is here. All right, third round. Best shirts win. Versus. Fake. I mean, uh, fight. Both of these are my shirts. And I finally have both my slogan and my art. Wedding. It's in Nantucket. Oh, talk about wedding country. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> it's really good. <laughs> I'm By the way, you can buy these shirts. Um. By the way, you can buy these shirts if you you can uh, here. I'll I'll try and post. Somebody post the link. Let me see if I can pull myself up.
Uh, mayonnaise, thank you. Yeah, if you want to buy the shirts, uh, you can do so by clicking that link. Um, they're, they range from anywhere from $18 to $22 depending on your shirt size. <coughs> My god, though, that... Alright. Um, Alright, cousin, which game do you want to play next? Um, or do you guys want to call it here? Thank you for the biddies. Now here's some kitties. <laughs> Toilet chocolate is good. <laughs> I don't know, you can pick another one. Uh... Okay. Alright. Alright, you know what? Here, we're gonna, we're gonna finish off. Uh... I don't know if, I don't know if we're gonna end, end tonight, but um... We are going to do a game called Fibbage. Um, this was one of the original Jackbox games that came with, uh, let's see, is it Party Pack? Yeah, it's Party Pack 4. Okay. So we're going to play a game called Fibbage. <coughs> and this game is very easy, by the way. So in Fibbage, what, what you do is you're given a, everyone's given the same prompt, and you have to lie, you have to make up an answer. You have to lie and make up an answer. Yeah. So. <coughs> okay. Uh, yeah. So, in Fibbage 3, you, you lie and make up an answer with the prompt they give you, and then you have to go throughout the answers and find the truth. Let's make sure I have everything loaded. Okay, full screen, audience, extended timers, requ require Twitch. Okay. A lot of room code hiding, yes. Okay. Alright, let me get the room code, but my god, the toilet chocolate is good. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let me get the code. Okay. And there is the code. X, C, Z, Z. <coughs> X C C Z. Sorry about that. Um. <laughs> All right. Okay. It's X C Z Z. It's the room code's right on right on the page there. Remember to log in with your Twitch. Uh, Jackbox TV. Remember to log in with your Twitch account. X. There we go. Okay. Uh, the eyeballs mixed with plants it makes me very uncomfortable. Yeah. Now you can read it right off the screen. Um, yeah, the, yeah, Fibbage 3, the graphics are very, I saw the ham, ham thing, and I knew that was the one, and the toilet chocolate was the one I died to, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have to make a clip of that, or somebody can go back and make a clip of that, <coughs> boy do I need some NyQuil when I get off. Um, okay, is that it? Yeah, it looks like it's it. So, like I said, everyone's gonna give the same prompt, 
and you have enough time to fill in the blank. It's it's a it's a fill in the blank type game. Um. Yeah. So. Um. Yeah. You 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 fill in the you fill in the blank. You make up lies, and then you have to find the truth among all the lies. And each each person is each person is given a category. You have to pick the category first before you start. So. All right. Here we go. Oh wait, hang on. Look in the game first, dummy. There we go. Here we go. It's Fibbage 3! I am Cookie, and this entire game is powered by three otters and a wheel. Pretty cool, huh? Hey, it's my three favorite people. And you. Oh, and uh, anyone else can get in and join the audience. Audience members try to spot the truth and choose their own lies to fake out the players. Let's go. This is round one, and that means you get 500 for each player you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll score 1,000 for finding the truth. And whoever whoever picks their lie, the person who made the lie gets points. All right, there's the category honorary titles. Queen Elizabeth II, Bill Murray, and Big Bird may not have a lot in common, but they've all earned the honorary title of <laughs> blank. Now enter a bluff on your device that sounds real enough to fool the other players. If you're stuck for half the points, you can hit the lie for me button and get a suggestion. Do it. <coughs> Hey, Night Paper, how you doing? Um, Night Paper, uh, um, if you want to, uh, join us at jackbox.tv, uh, link your Twitch account, and go to the room code up in the upper left corner, and you could vote and influence the uh, influence uh, the game. This is the game for the audience. Find the truth and enter it on your device. Okay, so Queen Elizabeth II, Bill Murray, and Big Bird may not have a lot in common, but they all earn the honorary title of blank. Is it oldest bird, master baiter, Nebraska admiral, knight, or lady? Also, you can pick the best answer after you after you pick your after you vote on the on your answer. All right, let's see what you guys picked. Is it lady? No, that was mayonnaise's life, So mayonnaise gets points. Ah, that was my lie. Well, I get points. The governor of this totally landlocked state has handed out the honorary title since 1931. Ha! Huh. Okay. Alright, choose a category. Nice. Okay, uh... Ooh. Dirty Dirty. Let's see how this goes. <coughs> At least seven different mountain peaks in Utah share the odd name blank. Okay, enter your lies. Also, mayonnaise, thanks for the uh, 100 bits, I appreciate it. <laughs> Hurry, <coughs> and night paper, yes, I'm still sick. Alright. Ooh, almost at, almost out of time. Ooh, just in time. Okay, cool. here you go. Find the at least seven different mountain peaks in Utah I'll share the odd name. Is it Mormon Net Tabernacle Choir, Tuesday Intercourse Hill, The Happy Trail, or Molly's Nipple?
Let's see how things shook out. Is it the happy trail? Asked I picked it. No, it, it was my cousin's lie. Is it Intercourse Hill? No, that was Bastai's lie. Picked by mayonnaise. Polly's nipple. That was the truth. Okay. They get taller in the winter. <coughs> <coughs> Happy trail. All right, mayonnaise. Pick a category. Time to pick a category. Winter Sorry, peaks, eh? You. Yeah. All right, pick a category, dude. There we go. Twins. Okay, here's your question. In 2017, Kerry Funk of the Pew Research Center released the results to an interesting study of almost 8,000 twins, which hoped to see if they had identical blank. Write your lies now. Okay, so in 2017, Carrie Funk of the Pew Research Center released the results of an interesting study of almost 8,000 twins which hoped to see if they had identical blank. All Is right. it poop sizes, penises, brains, genitalia, or political beliefs? Okay, let's take a look. So, me and my cousin put brains. That was Bazatai's lie? Good job, Bazatai. Is it genitalia? No, that was my lie. I think I spelled genitalia wrong. The political beliefs. That was the truth, picked by mayonnaise. Good job, mayonnaise. So twins usually do share political views, but they only express them with creepy ESP. <laughs> All right. Okay, here's round two. All the points are doubled. All right, best type, pick a category. All right, escape. Okay, here's the question. During World War II, the British helped their captured soldiers escape German prison camps by hiding compasses, files, and maps inside blank. Type in your lies now. Okay. Sorry. So, during World War II, the British helped their captured soldiers escape German prison camps by hiding compasses, files, and maps inside blank. Okay, take Is a it look and find the truth. Bratwurst, Monopoly games, underwear, pigeons, or rectums? Yeah, let's see that. Let's see what everybody selected. Is it Bratwurst? That was Manny's lie. Pigeons. Nope, oh, that was my cousin's lie. Monopoly games. Really? That's the, the truth? was carrying enough drinking water in that tiny thimble. <coughs> Crazy. Category. <coughs> <coughs> All right. Capitol Rotunda. 
Okay, focus yeah, that does seem really easy to catch. In 1921, Ugh. a statue commemorating women's in suffrage was in the U.S. Capitol Rotunda. The next day, day, Congress made the odd decision to move it to blank. Move it to... Enter your lies now. <laughs> All right, so in 1921, a statue commemorating women's suffrage was unveiled in the U.S. Capitol Rotunda. The next day, Congress made the odd decision to move it to blank. Write something quick or use the lie for me, buddy. <coughs> <coughs> uh, yeah. uh. Okay, is okay, it New Orleans? Is it a new speech in Florida? Is it Warren G. Harding's house, the basement, or an old men's hospital? Oh, I want to say Warren G. Harding's house, but I know I'm wrong. I love this part. Fast time, that was a very good lie. was a complete miss. They did eventually put it back on display 75 a, a years fantastic later. Fantastic lie, yes it was. Underneath a glass ceiling. Orangey Harding's house. Generations, Russian mothers had soothed their children's minor bumps and bruises by saying what translates to it'll heal before blank. All right, type in your lies. Okay. For generations, Russian mothers have sued their children's minor bumps and bruises by saying uh, what translates to, it'll heal before blank. <coughs> Hurry, hit the live for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, where's the truth? <coughs> Is it you learn your manners, your wedding, the doctor comes, death, or the borscht cools down? All right, who picked what? Is it before the doctor comes? Nope, that was past Ty's life. That was a good lie. When the Porsche cools down, that was my life. Thanks. Thank you, Bastai. Oh, mayonnaise. You learn your manners, that was well, good. Well, so much for that one. For your wedding? Uh, my girlfriend is Russian. I really thought that was the answer. Here is the final oh, fibbage. The final fibbage. Hit your last chance. <coughs> Don't blow it. Now, for the final fibbage, there's two answers. Teach kids an important lesson. Bernie Carl of Alaska wants to put a blank of blank in every public school. Enter your lies now. Okay, so in an attempt to teach kids an important lesson, Bernie Carl Velasco wants to put blank 
a blank in every public school. <coughs> Sorry. Still coughing. Almost done, almost done. Oh, right, the last second. All right, where's the truth? Is it a skeleton of a caveman in public schools? A pack of moose in every school. A nun of punishment in every public school. A tower of lettuce in every school. A picture of the president in every public school. What did people pick? A pack of moose. Oh, cousin, that was a good one. Oh, mayonnaise! Great lie there. Here's something you might be interested in. It's to teach kids how to grow their own food, and is in no way tied to the conspiracy that most teachers are just giant rabbits in rubber masks. <coughs> All right, mayonnaise. You get to pick the next game. We can do we can do trivia. Um, it was to grow their own food. <coughs> and my cousin got the most likes. Um. So, uh, Mayonnaise, would you like to bow out, or would you like to pick another game? Um, we can do, we can do more Fibbage, we can do Quiplash, we can do a drawing game, we can do a trivia game, we can do a word game. You wanna play this again? Okay. Okay. All right. Same teams. Here we go. <coughs> I'm gonna get a drink of water. Hey there, I'm Cookie, and this entire game is made from reclaimed barn wood. Look at that. Four players. You know what I call a four-player game? Four play. I just add the this word. Probably be my last one. Okay. My favorite band, and then I take out the word cold. It equals four play. Oh, and anyone else who wants to get in can be in the audience. You can vote on decoy answers to trip up the players, and you get to take a shot at guessing the truth. Let's play. Okay, cool. This is round one. You'll pick up 500 points for everybody you fool, and you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. Give me a category. All right. Pick a category, mayonnaise. Porn challenge. Okay. Okay, here's your first question. The adult site woodrocket.com shot a 2015 promotional video where porn actors attempted to blank. Okay, enter your lies. So the adult site woodrocket.com shot a 2015 promotional video where porn actors attempted to blank. Hurry up, use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, which one's the truth? Uh, cry on demand. Is it cry on demand? Is it sing opera? Wear clothes the whole time. Keep their clothes on for a full day and throw the throw the far, uh, farthest. K. 
Okay, <coughs> was it Sing Opera? Nope, that was bad. Bad ties lie. Keep their clothes on for a full day. Nope, that was my cousin's lie. Cry on demand. Okay. Because when watching porn, you shouldn't have to cry alone. All right, cousin. Pick a category. Bad touch. Oh boy. And the question is, among the advice given to Game of Thrones actor Amelia Clark by her mother was, "Don't do drugs, have sex, or touch your blank." Write your lies now. So among the advice given to Game of Thrones actor Mealy Clark by her mother was don't have, don't you drugs have sex or touch your blank. Okay, which one is the truth? Is it makeup, eyebrows, belly button, boyfriend, or happy trail? Let's see what everybody picked. Is it makeup? Nope, that was Vanny's lie. Is it eyebrow? Oh, is eyebrows? Okay. Now that I could believe might lead to blindness. Okay. Mm, okay. All right, fast high, pick a category. Trump science. Here's the question. <coughs> Trump took office. Scientists at the Research Council's UK decided to send their US colleagues blank. <laughs> Type in your lies now. Okay. After President Trump took office, scientists at the Research Council's UK decided to send their US colleagues blank. Okay, Is it stress choices. balls, hard drugs, rubber duckies, life preservers, or their condolences? Okay, what did everyone pick? Is it rubber duckies? No, that was my lie. Rubber ducky, you're the one. You make bad times so much fun. Was it life preservers? That was my cousin's life, which I picked. Was it stress balls? It was stress balls. Okay. They were going to buy their own, but it would have drained their budget. <coughs> Hard drugs. On to round two, where all point values are doubled. All right, uh, let's see. Superman trance. Okay. Here's a question for you. Action comics number 592 and 593 are notable because a villain with psychic powers forces Superman to blank. Enter your lies now.
Okay, so in Action Comics number 592 and 593 are notable because of, uh, <laughs> with psych <laughs> psychic powers forces Superman to blank. Okay, seek the truth. Is it... Is it poop in his costume? Make a sex tape, molest Lois Lane, harm innocence, marry Lois Lane. Uh... Alright, who picked what? Is it harm innocence? That was... Man, he's just like, that was a good line. Marry Lois Lane. <laughs> sick. What? <laughs> and in a tiny thought bubble, he thinks, Ooh, just think of Krypton exploding. Just think of Krypton exploding. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I do that the left right answer. All right, mayonnaise, pick a category. Odd names. All right, here it is. In 2013, a 23-year-old man was jailed by Singaporean police on theft and drug charges. When they checked his ID card, they found he had the odd name of blank. Okay, enter your lies. Okay, in 2013, a 23-year-old man was jailed by Singaporean police on theft and drug charges. When they checked his ID card, they found he had an odd name of blank. Okay, look for the truth and pick it. Uh, is it not guilty, Batman been Superman, Jesus H. Christ, McLovin, that not me? See what everybody selected. Is it Jesus H. Christ? Nope, that was my lie. <laughs> Batman been super man. That's the truth. I remember that. I remember that story on a circular uh, circulating around on Facebook a long time ago. Time to check in with my fellow celebrities. Celebrity media. I get my PhD in memes. Celebrity tweets. In 2010, <coughs> Kevin Durant tweeted, Twitter is better than blank. All right, type in your lies. Okay. Kevin Durant tweeted, Twitter is better than blank on 8th of May 2010, KD Trey 5. Alright, pick the truth. Is it popping champagne, going to the club, P word, uh, the shitter, or MySpace? Alright, let's see what you guys picked. Is it popping champagne? No, that was Bass Tie Sly. Is it my space? Nope. <coughs> You're going to the club. Going to the club was the truth. That might sound hard to believe, but remember that in 2010, Kevin Durant lived in Oklahoma City. Uh. All right. And here's the final fibbage. It's got two it's answers. It's final fibbage time. Pay Again. attention, because this last one's worth triple points. Have fun. On June 2nd, 2017, a man in Augusta, Maine, wanted to protest his town government. So he blank, 100 blank, inside City Hall. Write your lies now.
Okay, sorry about co the cough, but um, here we go. On June 2nd, 2017, a man in Augusta, Maine, wanted to protest okay, his city's to town turn. government, so he blank 100 blank inside City Hall. Is it released 100 bees, released 100 bed bugs, uh, forced 100 pigs, uh, flew 100 pigeons, or shouted 100 curse words? Oh god, not the bees! Not the bees! <sighs> not the bees! Forced 100 pigs. Released 100 bees. Oh, that was mayonnaise is life. Shattered 100 curse words. Oh, that was Baz Ty's life. Try this on for size. Released 100 big bugs. Oof. <coughs> All right, Mayonnaise wins again. And... Uh, so is a repeat of last game. All right. Uh, I think that's gonna do that for, uh, do it for me tonight. Um, I gotta... Ah, uh, yeah, GG's. GG's all around. That was good. Um, that was a lot of fun. So thank I'm, you for the biddies. Now here's some kitties. Mayonnaise. Thank you for the hundred bits again. Uh, I do appreciate it. Um, I hope you all like Jackbox. We're gonna play this again. Uh, we're gonna play all the Jackbox games again on the 27th. So mark your calendars. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, again, Mayonnaise, thank you for the 200 bits total. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go back and clip the toilet chocolate t-shirt thing, because that was funny. That was so funny. Oh my gosh. Okay, um, but we're gonna go back and raid somebody. Uh, let's go raid somebody here. Uh, oh, we're gonna raid my buddy Dan Jones. Um, cause, yeah, he's playing Bloodborne right now. So, yeah. Um, alright, everybody, go say hi to Dan Jones, give him a follow, he is awesome. He is the hero to the people. Call that to him on his channel and say, Hero to the people, Dan Jones! He's awesome. Cause he's Dan Jones. Alright, we'll see you another time. Have a good night.